Hey guys, what's up? It's Alex over at Laser Everything, and this is a quick update to our SFX 60 watt M7 review. So shortly after the review was complete and uploaded, SFX reached out to me with some shocking news. They say, what a great video. Thanks for your in-depth review. I noticed you talked about the difference between the 60 watt MOPA E and C series. And yes, the C series has a 2.0 millijoule max pulse energy, which makes its performance more excellent than the E series with 1.5 millijoules. I have to say, we've been selling MOPA C series, but one day we found our price is not competitive anymore due to the E series being so much cheaper. We lost quite a number of customers to the E series sellers, even when we said our C series is better. Most of our customers would not know the exact difference and the price is what they do care about. So we have to change our strategy from C to E series and lower our price to compete. And you can find our price get down a lot as most of the sellers would not say that difference. We hope you can understand us under the highly competitive market and truly thanks for your efforts to make such a meticulous video. We apologize for the inconvenience caused by our changes, but we have to. Uh, and that was from Oscar Wang, uh, a representative over at SFX Laser. So essentially this voids a huge chunk of my review. Uh, part of what made this unit so special was that we had an awesome 60 watt M7 M-R source and we were getting it for eight grand out the door. Uh, unfortunately, as is usually true on the internet, if something is too good to be true, it probably is. And that was the case here. Uh, so. What I essentially had them do is change the link that we dropped in the description to the source for the 60 watt M7 M R, but it is now an extra 1300 bucks. Uh, if you buy the sources from just the, the, the market uh, at market price, usually you're going to be spending like 2000 to $2,200 more on the M R than you're going to spend on the E series. So it's still a decent deal. They are eating some of it, but it is more expensive. So now you can get the E series for $7,999 and you can get the M-R, the C series, if you want to call it that, for $9,299. It's considerably more expensive. It's, it's another $1,300 for sure. Is it still worth it? Yeah, I think so. Uh, I, I think it's still worth it. I still mean everything that I said about the machine in the review. Still an excellent machine, still business class, still no frills, all of that stands. But the part about the, the price point and the value just isn't really there anymore. It's still a decent deal. Uh, it's, it's not a bad deal. You're not getting ripped off, uh, especially considering everything with the, uh, the shipping and not having to deal with imports and yada yada. We covered all that in the main review. It's a decent deal uh, and it's a great machine, but the thing about the laser source there, really unfortunate news. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Uh, this is a, an important update and uh, I, I thank you for watching it. Uh, please for, forgive me for the, uh, the, the error in my video. I wish I had known about this sooner. I reviewed the unit I was sent and I shared the link that um, I was supposed to share. So, uh, you know, this stuff does happen. I, I, I look a little further into, into things than I think most people expect me to look into them. So uh, this kind of stuff is bound to come up every now and then. Um, I, I ask them to honor purchases made in the last 24 hours with the M-R. So uh, if you made that purchase, please reach out to them. Make sure that that is the case. Uh, otherwise, you may want to cancel and replace your order for either the appropriate source or ask for a refund. Um, if anybody needs help with that, I'm absolutely available and I can reach out to them on your behalf if for some reason something goes wrong. That said, Venus and Oscar are awesome. They, they're super nice. They're totally understanding really great guys. And I still really like SFX as a company. Um, I think this was just a miscommunication. Um, I still stand by the company. I still definitely stand by the product. I love that thing. Uh, but I just wanted to take some time to clarify. So uh, hopefully I didn't run on with that for too long. I don't want this video to go on forever, but I definitely felt like it needed an update so that you guys knew what the real deal was uh, as far as the price points for these different sources. So uh, we now have links to the E-Series and the full power unit down in the description for you to check out and pick between. And uh, I hope this one helped you out, guys. I'm not gonna bore you with the whole outro thing today. Just a quick update video. Thank you so much for watching Laser Everything, and I will see you in the next one.